The video stars Penn Badgley, who I've been, I've been a fan of my entire life. So it was just so amazing to work with him. I'm such a fan. It was He's so He's a fun. good guy. Yeah, yeah. super honest. Honestly, guys, I didn't know I was going to make a video on this, but I thought, you know what, let's do it. Because, guys, I was watching Ariana Grande's interview with Jimmy Fallon, and she said, Penn Badgley? from the famous Gossip Girl, from from you, from Easy A, is in the music video. That girl is frippin', she's genius. Genius! Cause, I love that man. Love him, love his acting, love him, love him. Been obsessed with him, okay, I'm not obsessed. I'm not obsessed, but I was like, okay. Okay guys, like, yeah. I need to watch this video and I actually haven't heard the song. Um, I think the song that she was talking about that he's in it is called That Boy Is Mine. Um, I've heard a bit of it on TikTok. On, I, what did I just say like that? TikTok. TikTok. Um, that boy is mine. So I was like, okay, well, let's just do a reaction video to it. Apparently she's got more celebrity friends in it as well. So I can't wait to see who will be watching, so let's just get right into it and watch a music video. I'm gonna go and turn off the lights because my living room lights blocks out the TV, which is absolutely annoying. It'll be annoying for you, it'll be annoying for me, so bear with me. Okay, cool. Everyone can see, let's get start up. Oh, you can see, you can see. Perfect. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This ain't the first mayor that said he was gonna clean up this city. And it won't be the last. How much you wanna bet this scumbag don't make it two weeks? Oh, get back! Get him off! Oh, fuck! Get him off! They're on my back! They're on my back! Is this an ad? Fast, painless, oh. and instantly effective. Call Brian. Oh, she looks so cute! Glinda, baby! Bring on the potion! ...to address the media any moment now for a press conference. Yes, if there's any idea what that might be about. Well, with the laundry list of oh, wait, that's on the daily, it's anyone's game. You that's know what it is. He did run a fantastic campaign based around bringing immediate change to the city. Well, here's his chance to put his money where his mouth is. Thank you. Good evening. Oh. <gasps> I've arranged this press conference after thorough deliberation. It's like Joe is come back from the dead as someone else. To address a great and insidious threat. Okay, he's a mayor. The sanctity of our beloved city. That is our rat infestation. Fuck those rats. As you know, the rats have plagued the city for too long, spreading disease, terrorizing homes, destroying power grids and other infrastructure, bringing many of our essential workers to their brink. Even if he's acting so, so good, or, oh! I have created a specialized committee with our city's animal control. Our okay. team has been hard at work on the ground. We have gathered the city's overflow of stray cats. And we will release them, hungry, into the streets to combat this problem at its source. It's fucking brilliant. So hot. Right? <laughs> so hot! Thank you. Oh. We got a 
They're just having a normal conversation. Look, Joe has met her match. He met his match. He met his match. Before I even talk, let me even put my lip gloss on because Ariana Grande's lips were looking oh, oh, absolutely lush. So let me just. Yeah. Right. There we go. Now it makes sense to continue. Okay, guys. Wow. It was like really sexy, like in an old fashioned way. Like the whole, I loved it. I love, I love the mood, the tone, the whole vibe of the music video, nice and short and sweet. And you know, Ariana just being herself and like honestly, like really funny in a very subtle way where she was like, oh, he's a genius, so hot. Like honestly, something that we all said when we see Pen Badly, when he's playing Joe, like he is an insane man, very genius, but he's so hot, which is very disturbing in the most, it's disturbing. It's disturbing like how we've fallen in love with a sociopath forever. But um, to have in this music video, absolutely genius. And then she turns into, transforms into Catwoman. Freaking hell, just looking so cute. And the audacity for her to just break into his house and he's just on the bed. And Joe not even like oh, freaking out. He's just like, you know, it's just, I don't know. I don't know why I'm calling him Joe. I think in the show, in the music video, it's called Max or something like that. It's just honestly, when I see him, it's like you've died and we all escaped and reincarnated to someone else. You changed your name. So in this music video, you're Max, and you've met your match crazy. Love is dead, and now you have Ariana Grande, who went from geek wearing geek glasses to being Catwoman, and she's in your house obsessed with you because she's got paintings of you all over the wall, and she's saying, that boy is mine, and literally in the end, they ended talking together, playing with a cat. So yeah. I am here for it. Uh, the song was a banger. I can't believe I actually haven't listened to her album yet. Now I need to, I think tonight, as I go to bed, I'm gonna listen to her album. I've heard very good things about it. Um, so yeah, Ari Ariana Grande is a very talented girl and I think th this is her year, obviously, cause you know, Wicked, Wicked is happening and she's playing Glinda along with Cynthia and Jonathan Bailey. It's happening on Thanksgiving day. So, you know, me and my girls, we're gonna go to every man cinema and watch it. But you know, Ariana Grande is very, very talented. Um, I love her voice. She has like so much versatility and it's like very, that boy is mine. <laughs> Sounds weird when I do it, but it's good. It's better when she does it. Seeing her journey from 
victorious to like where she is now. Honestly, genuinely so impressed and of how much she's achieved. And it's nice to see that she's still, she's doing okay regardless of what people are saying. Like, honestly, I, I, I like, I like. Ariana Grande as an artist I think she's very talented and yeah she's very talented and wait hold on if I forget Brandy oh she brought Brandy Brandy from Cinderella baby who's actually also in the new descendants I'm not gonna watch the new descendants I will not do that because I feel like as much as it's good to evolve and have new things and let, let go, I can't let go of the original cast. Like, I just can't. And I just don't think it would be fair. So I'm not going to watch the new Descendants, even though Brandy's in it. Rita Ora is in it as well. That'll be very interesting to see. I'm going to let my sibling, my sister, my little sister's going to watch it. I'll let her, I'll get her verdict. If she says it's good, like generally good, then maybe. But for now, it's like, I'm literally like a hard, hardcore no. I'm like, I'm not watching it. I don't care what celebrity you bring me. As much as I love Brandy and I'm not, <laughs> I'm not gonna watch it. But anyway, as I digress, um, I love the music video. I love the song. I was really bopping to it. Um, Ariana Grande, um, the, the storytelling was absolutely beautiful. I love, uh, my favorite part actually was when she, as she was like Catwoman and she was like viewing um, Joe. Max, but I call him Joe. Um, from the top of the window, he was just doing it. I was just like, oh my god, I don't know. I felt like I don't know. I love that shot and like how the, the camera angles and the zooming when she even like my girl had a whip. That's wild, but she had a whip and it was like tied onto his like his feet and she was dragging him and the way the camera was like zooming onto. I was like, I love this. Like I really love how the editing was done and yeah. I honestly, I honestly, it felt like a old school vibe movie and I was just here for it. It was like a, maybe a spin off of Batman or something like that, but it was like, it was good. Like it was really, really good. So I really enjoyed it. But yeah guys, um, that's just me reacting to Ariana Grande's music video. I just thought, oh my gosh, I need to watch this. Like I watched her interview and she, when she said that he's in it, I was like, right, you got me. I'm watching um and yeah just drop like my thoughts about it and yeah and I'm now gonna go to listen to Ariana Grande's new album because I'm late and I heard many good things about it so I'm gonna go listen to it and check it out but yeah guys let me know your thoughts if you listen to the album let me know your favorite songs that you recommend and I'll go and listen to that too and maybe we can even compare notes but yeah guys thanks for watching and see you next time bye